Magma is the molten rock beneath volcanoes. It is filled with gas that expands as it erupts, like the bubbles in a fizzy drink when a bottle is opened. In explosive eruptions, this tears the magma apart and shatters solid rock. Those explosions form fragments of magma and rock, which range in size from a fine dust to boulders the size of cars. The finest material, the size of a grain of sand or smaller, is called volcanic ash. Rocks thrown from a volcanic vent are sometimes called volcanic bombs. The biggest rocks fall to the ground close to the volcano, where they can cause deaths, injuries, and damage. Large rocks can punch through roofs and sometimes set buildings on fire. The falling of smaller rocks is noisy, like a heavy hail storm. Towering clouds of rocks, ash, and gas are thrust above volcanoes during explosive eruptions. These volcanic clouds often reach heights of many kilometers, and in the largest eruptions may reach tens of kilometers high, well into the height that aircraft fly. The ash clouds are blown by the wind to tens to hundreds of kilometers from the volcano. The time taken to reach these distances depends on the speed of the wind. Day can turn to night when the thick, dense ash clouds block out the sun. As the volcanic clouds drift downwind, the material within them gradually falls to the ground. The thickest deposits form closest to the volcano, where buildings and land can be buried. Fine ash is transported further from the volcano, and the deposits normally become thinner. The finest ash can remain airborne for thousands of kilometers. Volcanic ash is quite different to the ash produced in a fire. It is made up of tiny, sharp fragments, making it extremely rough and abrasive, able to badly scratch car windscreens, for example. Volcanic ash can be harmful to people, animals, and the environment. Lands can be buried, roofs collapse, transportation, water resources, wastewater systems, power supplies, and communication systems can be disrupted, crops destroyed, and the livestock killed. In small eruptions, ash can prove to be a nuisance by disrupting everyday life. Scientists can study eruptions and wind patterns to provide warnings of the spread of volcanic ash. Authorities will advise the best course of action. This may include evacuation of areas close to the volcano and measures to protect yourself and your property. Over time, Communities living near regularly erupting volcanoes can develop good coping mechanisms for living with the hazards, and in the long term, volcanic ash can improve the fertility of the land.